I don't remember who asked, but one of my subscribers either commented or whatever. They um they asked me to do Don't Wake Daddy. I don't remember who. It may have been someone on Instagram it, that also follows my YouTube. It may have been a YouTube subscriber. I don't remember who asked. But somebody asked me to do Don't Wake Daddy. The alarm clock game that's set for fun. I don't remember who did it. But I told them I don't think I have it in the comments and I was mistaken I looked in was looking in my game room today and I found it I just saw it I was just randomly looking and it's on one of the shelves yay so I have a don't wait daddy for y'all guys today especially for that one subscriber of mine who requested it I apologize if I don't remember your name but Please comment down below if you're the subscriber that requested it so I can pin your comment and uh, give you a shout out. So, it's the middle of the night. You're in bed. You're starving. You'll have to creep through the house to the fridge, but can you do it without setting off Daddy's alarm clock? Shh. Hop. Shh. Hop out of, hop out of bed. Bend the color spinner. Move to the matching color space. Watch your step is dark. Oh no! You stepped on the cat and landed on the number five. Now push daddy's alarm clock five times. He could sleep through it. Or you woke daddy. And he sends you all the way back to bed to start over. Whoever reaches the refrigerator first wins. So let's check it out. Here's Daddy, and if you wake, <laughs> his hat comes off, that's cool, um, but you basically, you press this, eventually, it's going to pop up, man, even I jumped on that one, man, that, that's freaking awesome, but anyway, don't wake Daddy, so, I'll show y'all how to play the game. First of all, you gotta set up the board. Set up the board. You put daddy in the board. You gotta start. Don't wake daddy. And finish. So, uh, here's the rules. Who needs those, right? Here's them in Spanish. Anyway, here's the spinner. And here's some Don't Wake Daddy cards. And each player has... Each player... All the boys and girls look the same, sort of. But, uh... So they won't be discriminating with kids. Each player has a boy and a girl plan piece. So, I mean, technically you could have eight players. Each player could have to go through twice before they win. Um, basically, you're one of the players. You spin the spinner. You go to the green spot. Oh no, you accidentally stepped on the remote. You gotta press it six times. Whew, safe. Blue. You woke up the dog four times. Whew, safe. Star, I think star means you get a card. Card takes you all the way to there. Whew, safe. Yellow. Yellow. Oh crap. I turned the radio on. He's definitely going to wake up in six more smacks. 
Don't wake daddy. It's a shame I'm already there and have to start over again. Okay, so that's pretty much how you play it. I guess there's the spinner method to play it and it looks like there's also the possibility of the card method to play it. Where instead, you pick up a card, instead of spinning a spinner, you pick up a card, and you do what it says. That's it. Or we already looked at that one. Um, this one says parrot. So I'd go to the parrot space. This one shows a uh, um, pineapple. I go to the pineapple space. Damn, he jumped over the net one. Faster than I expected. Anyway, you go back. So that's how you play. So you got two different ways to play. Got the baseball, piano, pots and pans. <laughs> Roller skates, cat, baby, vase. Man, these kids are, are some. Another uh, <laughs> plate, TV. These kids are not very quiet. Uh, cuckoo clock, dog. Radio and bicycle. These kids are playing as they're trying to get to the kitchen. They're just playing. You got four characters red, blue, yellow, green. I mean, the heck. Now, I suppose there's a third way to play it. You could roll a die, one die, and go that many spaces. So you could play go to the space in the card. You could play spinner, star would mean get a card, and do whatever the cards, not go to the card, but do what the cards, numbers, spaces say. Um, or star could just mean press that once. Okay. So it looks like, if we go through here, it looks like we got the four beds, and start is the roller skates. Baseball. Baby. Wee! Wee! TV. Wow. Blink. Dog. Woof! 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 He makes me jump. Uh, bike. Vase. It's random too because it's not the same amount of clicks each time. Uh, uh, the cuckoo clock. Cuckoo, cuckoo, cuckoo. Blank. Parrot. What are you kids doing up? 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 What are you two kids doing up? What are you kids doing up? What are you kids? See? Blank. Oops, I dropped the picture. Psh. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, bum. The music. Microphone. Blank. Yeah, the radio would definitely wake him up. Six. And then pots and pans. Well, he ain't woke up, so yay, I get some food. Woohoo, food. Now, um, extreme difficulty, extra level modes 
or since you got two characters, both of them got to make it to the uh, refrigerator. Even more extreme difficulty is you have to make it all the way back to your bed after you've gotten to the refrigerator. Don't wake daddy. Damn, he makes me jump every time. I hope he's making you jump his you're watching this video because it's funny that he's making me jump. So I'm missing one stand and that's it. Other than that, don't wake daddy. Other than that, I got everything. So that's cool. Don't wake daddy. So that was don't wake daddy. Don't wake daddy. You wake daddy, you're gonna get in trouble, and it's I, I, I don't think I'm gonna get you. Don't think I, I can get I'll save you, because I ain't saving you. Whoa, is it all fly off on that one, man? It's nice. So, uh, I mean, it's pretty cool just to play to do this to see how many clicks you can get before he'll wake up. Whoever gets the most clicks wins. That's another version. <laughs> so, um,. That was Don't Wake Daddy. Now, another thing that is going to try to wake up Daddy are the bed bugs that are in the bed. Now, this is supposed to motorize. I need batteries for it to work. What you do is you put all these little uh, chicken bugs, bed bugs, chicken bugs. You put all these bed bugs on here, right? And, um, bed bugs. You take one of your things and you try to pick them up. I'll show you all how to play, but they won't be bouncing because I don't have batteries. See, you got all these bugs. They'll be bouncing and bouncing and bouncing, 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 and bouncing and bouncing and bouncing and bouncing. They'll be bouncing, right? So what you do is you go, try to grab, oh no. See, you try to grab your color. So I don't need the yellow. Give me that red. Come here. Which, it's hard enough with, to do it. It's hard enough to do it while they're not bouncing, let alone, oops, <laughs> that one went flying. Let alone try to, um, do it when they're bouncing. See? They're hard. Give me there. Yeah. But not only are you doing it, but your opponents are doing it too. So you got like two people trying to do it at the same time. Or three people. Or in this case, four people sometimes. So it's all going wild and crazy because they're bouncing. They're bouncing. They're bouncing. They're bouncing. They're bouncing. They're bouncing. All over the place. And you and your uh, four opponents are like snapping and the other ones are snapping and everybody's trapping and trying to get the uh, bad bugs. At the end of the game, whoever has the most bad bugs... Whoever can get all their bed bugs first wins the game! And that's how you play bed bugs. So, bed bugs! It's. There's 46 creepy crawly bugs, but I have two versions of the game, so I got double the bugs! Double the bugs! Are hopping, leaping, and a jumping all over a shaking, quaking bed. Can you use your grab and snatch and tongs to catch and capture them? Bed bugs! So, uh. That was a uh, bed bugs. Bed bugs. And don't wake daddy. So, uh, I guess you could play bed bugs first. Because the bed bugs are what's keeping daddy up all night. All night. Up all night. Where none of y'all can get to the refrigerator, that's right. Get to the refrigerator, that's right. Until y'all catch and exterminate all the bed bugs. And then after playing bed bugs, which after playing bed bugs, y'all can play don't wake daddy because they got pretty much the same colors: the green, red, yellow, blue, right? Green, green, red, yellow, and a blue. Well, yeah, blue. So, uh. Don't wake daddy and get rid of the bed bugs. These are two cool, cool, um, 
pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool games, pretty cool, pretty cool games. Hey, we're gonna put Daddy on top of the other of the big bad guy, and watch this. Oh, come on. Don't wake daddy. I wonder what would happen if I put a bed bug or, or two on them. I'll put one of each can. Just for fun. Yeah, I know I had to pick them up. Don't wake daddy. That one fell off anyway. <laughs> nice, they only fell on the thing because it's side, so I had to pick them up. But anyway, that's been Don't Wake Daddy and Bed Bugs. Two cool, exciting, fun kids' uh, games by Milton Bradley. Um, hope you enjoyed this reviews of these. Pretty cool games. And, uh, I hope y'all like my, I hope y'all like my channel. I hope y'all subscribe. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe. Remember, God is good all the time. And all the time, God is good. And Jesus loves you. And, uh, keep on gaming. And don't wake daddy. And, I hope y'all don't ever get any bed bugs either. Not real ones anyway, because they're not fun. Um, so, have a great day.